All right, it's Friday, baby. Couple notes before we get uh, started on the stimulus. Uh, the work, the classes, I, the sessions I've attended this week, we spent too much time lollygagging in the warm up. Right when that clock hits minute seven of the 60 minute session, we got to be moving into the next component. All right. So what that looks like is a less than one minute introduction of the warm up. Then I'm chatting, cracking jokes, making sure everyone feels comfortable during those seven minutes of the warm up. We just want people moving. Okay. At minute seven, that's when we get the barbells out, we rack it and we start warming up the front squat, okay? Do a quick demo, let's get people on the J-hooks partnering up and give them about, with a demonstration, a few uh, seeing and correcting pieces, it shouldn't take longer than seven minutes, okay? Then, if we went all eight sets every other minute, that should give us enough time to make sure we also get a cool down in at the end of the, um, the session today, okay? The front squat today, nothing in particular, just making sure, what I want you looking at is making sure that bar is firmly placed on the shoulders and a shelf is created. Now, we always say elbows up, but a good tip today is to remind athletes, the reason elbows go up is so I can create a shelf for the bar to sit on, okay? So maybe have athletes warm up with a zombie squat just to simulate that um, shelf on the deltoid, okay? Uh, all right, and then the Metcon. Same exact Metcon, three rounds for time, rest six minutes, and then one round for time, but of 3x of the movements we did previously. In other words, we're doing the same amount of volume in both components. You're going to score the slower time of both of them, okay? This is a great opportunity for athletes to mix and match levels, okay? They will score on the leaderboard the lower level of the two, but encourage athletes, don't worry so much about the leaderboard, encourage athletes to mix and match. So if I'm really good at front squats and really bad at pull-ups, then I'm going to do maybe a yellow in my pull-ups and a brown for my front squats or vice versa, okay? Encourage mixing and matching, please. All right, um, really not a whole lot to today's workout as far as demonstration. Um, I would go squat cleans right into the front squats. The front squats should be unbroken on this first segment. They will not be unbroken on the second segment. If they are, the bar is too late, okay? That's kind of clear. Same thing with pull-ups. Pull-ups should be close to, if not unbroken, on the first segment. They will not be unbroken at all on the second segment. Probably four sets. Um, if they are, it's, it's too much of a uh, scaling. Anyway, quick three-minute video. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'm excited for the weekend, guys. College football season is almost here. Make sure all your athletes know September 3rd, Ohio State's playing Notre Dame.